There are a lot of accidents in the road every year. They are all caused by one thing, not following the road safety rules. So today, we will tell you on what happens if you don't follow the road safety rules. Because road safety is everyone's responsibility. Our group will tell you the effects of not following the road safety rules through the different scenarios and with the concepts of physics. So here are the effects of not following the road safety rules. The first scenario we have here is overspeeding. It happens a lot of times on the roads, especially when your car is the only car on the road. So here, we see Jazz deciding to go to the gym now, but he has to take the highway to go to the gym. Yo, the speed limit is 60. Nah, dude. I don't care about the speed limit. I go 120 kilometers per hour. Let's refer on this video right here on what happens if you overspeed on the highway. Like the ambulance right here and the fire truck. The so two cars have very high speeds. They bump each other with very high amount of force, resulting the people driving going to the hospitals for injuries. Next situation we have here is drunk driving. It is seen a lot of times in the road because people are tired, drunk, and they want to go home from their parties. Here we see Jazz and Robin feeling drunk after having a few drinks. In this simulation right here, we see a car just driving, but inside the car is the jog driver. He just goes straight and he ends up getting hit by the other car. The next situation we have here is when the passenger or driver doesn't wear their seatbelts in the car. So here, we see Jazz just telling Puno to wear seatbelts, but Puno doesn't want to wear seatbelts. We see a car that has lost control because of the amount of force that he has on his car. After, we see two passengers coming out of the car due to the high amount of force in this simulation. Here it is zoomed in. Situation right here, we show you and not how much if you don't follow the traffic rules. Oh, here we see Jazz, Robin, and Puna deciding to play basketball, but they have to drive to the car. What happens if you don't follow the traffic rules? Car targets the car because they're not following the rules. We should be careful on the road. Because of our mistakes, we can cause accidents, which can lead to injury or even death. This is all related to physics because the law of inertia is present in this, the situations. This law states that an object in motion continues in motion in the same speed and direction unless acted upon by an unbalanced force. When a car bumps something, an unbalanced force acts upon the car and decelerates it to rest so that passenger or he or she is not wearing a seatbelt. When a person is gets bumped by a moving car, the person will, will go in the opposite direction because of the force of the car. You should have knowledge about physics because it could help us understand the speed of the car and how long it would take to stop. We should know the relationship of the distance of the car and the time it will take to stop. Understanding this will help us prevent accident because we don't want any more victims on the road.